Yo guys, what is up man? I am Slim and welcome back to Clash Royale. This episode we're trying out something once again a little bit different. I'm going back to the beginning of the game. For all of you guys who are just starting out, you know what I'm talking about. You know this deck right here. This is like one of the first decks you get in Clash Royale. One of the very beginner decks. You use this against the trainer, you use this against your first couple of arenas. I'm doing a flashback in time, and I'm going to see if this thing still works. There's no legendaries, of course. There's barely a, there's barely anything above an epic. There's just a baby dragon. That's as bad as, this is as bad as it gets. It's based around the giant. I made a couple of spells in there. Let's see if this works. I'm, I'm really curious to see if it works. We're going right to the live ladder, too. This is like a throwback. This feels, this gives me memories of back in January when this game first came out and I pretended like I lived in Canada just so I could download it. I mean, nothing changed. We're still putting archers behind the tower to start out. We're still waiting for him to go first, just like all you beginners and guys who just started the game should be doing. You should always be waiting for your opponent to go first when you're running a tank deck. The giant is the tank. And you want to put things like the archers behind it. These are just some beginner tips. If you guys want a beginner episode, like a little tutorial, let me know down below in the comment section. See, he dropped first, so I'm putting the archers behind the tower. And I'm trying to get my giant in front of him to shield for the archers. He fireballs it. That's a negative elixir trade. Four is the cost of a fireball. Three is the cost of archers. So I don't really think that's a good idea. If you're going to fireball something, make sure it's of equal or greater value to the fireball my giant's hanging out in front of the musketeer i'm putting the baby dragon back there for double support he he's got elite barbarians but oh we got arrows too we got arrows get the arrows down in time oh my god we still get a couple hits on the tower the baby dragon's barreling down i think he's out of elixir he's got nothing left to defend it now the baby dragon's just tearing apart his tower look at this 1500 damage on his tower 1500 health I should say we just we just kicked his butt he made a bad play those elite barbarians didn't do enough the baby dragon couldn't be touched by him because they're ground units this is a good elixir trade the witch I think is five elixir it's four elixir for the fire the fireball we still have to do a little bit extra damage to it but that's what we have a baby dragon for look at this he doesn't like to try too hard this game. He likes it to be easy, so he uses the Royal Giant. Look at this. Look at this push, man. This is what positive elixir trades will do for you. We have the arrows. We're going to use our arrows. That's a great elixir trade right there. I don't really think I'm too worried about this ice wizard here, so we're going to drop the giant right in front. Archer's right behind him. Fireball for the witch. Elite Barbarians are here. I, I'm not too worried. He logs it backwards. That did not work out for him. Defend the tower with the knight. Musketeer back for support. Here comes the fireball, but the fireball doesn't hit it. The fireball does not hit the musketeer. We're in a little bit of trouble here. The baby dragon's out in front. I would have liked to put my giant down. Uh-oh. Getting a little serious here. We're going to have to try to just guess with the fireball. Uh-oh. Arrows might not do enough. I think we lost this match, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, the Royal Giant takes us out. This deck did not work. Not gonna happen. We lost it, man. We couldn't pull it off. We couldn't pull off the huge upset. Okay, so that didn't really work out too well. <sighs> All right. Let's get back into it, though. I think I can make this work. I like the way that match went. I think we can make this work. Let's get a win with this. We can do this. We can beat Hungry Henry from Phone Cubs. I'm pretty sure. I don't know who it is, but it sounds like a guy I could beat. I apologize to Mr. Hungry Henry if you're watching this, but I feel like I could beat you. Especially with a level 8 Mega Minion. Alright, Giant in front. I'm going to keep doing it. It's going to work. I'm telling you, I'm, I'm swearing by this classic deck right now. Oh, kill the Mega Minion. Thank you. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. That ain't good. That ain't good. We could take care of it, though, especially with the Baby Dragon on our side. Oh, please get one more hit. Oh, please. That was pathetic. Am I going to have to take my word back on this? Will this deck not work? 
Oh, can we tie it up? We can't tie it up. We can't tie it up. All right, what do we do here? We got a game plan. Let's just put the knight in the back. Maybe we can put the archers too. We'll put the giant in front. Here comes the mega minion. You know he's got the ice golem. You know he's got the elite barbs. I hope he throws down. Oh, this is gonna be sweet. Oh, look at that. Look at that trade. Do you realize how much I just took out with one fireball? Oh my god, that felt that felt great. Now we're gonna do work to the tower. I don't know where the elite barbs are, but they're not out yet. The elite barbs are not out yet, and we just did work to the tower. We might actually see a deck without a royal giant. How cool would that be? How cool would that be to actually see someone not using the royal giant? I, I think that'd be so cool. Alright, put the knight in front of the musketeer because she's almost dead. Now we gotta take out this ice golem. I think we can. Oh, do some work to the minions at least. Just get a couple shots, get a couple of kills. Oh, there we go. Now we only have to deal with one. And we got a goblet on the tower. Yes! We're gonna win with this deck. We're gonna win with the level one deck. I love it. Let's go. Regular push. Get this fireball ready. I'm holding it down. I'm ready to go. My thumb is on there. I can't even see. But here it is. The fireball will at least. Oh, we got half of an elite barb. We got half an elite barb. Perfect. Boom. You are here. Baby dragon, get the splash damage. Kill the ice golem because I need the splash damage. Oh, we got to put it down. Oh, please go after it. Yes. The, oh, my God. I put the goblins down so close to where that fireball was coming down. Oh, my God. Good thing for that delay. Oh my god, this is unbelievable. Keep putting that down. I think we're going to win. I think we're going to win. 19 seconds left. Okay, get this down. Musketeer's down. The giant's down just to soak up some damage. Oh my god, I'm running out of ideas, guys. I need the arrows, but there's still 10 seconds left. I have to last 10 seconds. I think I can. He's he's using the free... <laughs> he's just doing a desperate fireball. I think I won. Oh, I'm waiting for the royal giant to come out. Can he still put the royal giant down? It's No, my god, it's too late. I think we won. We got it, guys. Oh, my God. We did it. I told you it was possible. We at least got one win. We got one win above 4,000 cups. We're at 43.09. And we just used the beginner deck to win a match. I don't think there's anything else I could do to this to make it any more beginner. <laughs> maybe, like, maybe the bomber. Am I really going to put a bomber in here right now? I'm about to do it. Yo, comment down below. You remember this deck from when you just started this game. This was the deck. This was like the deck right here. This is what we used. Oh my goodness. Zoo, good luck. Thank you. I appreciate that. We're going to need it. We're going to need it after what these matches have been looking like. All right. What are we going to do here? Let's wait for him to go. <laughs> I gotta follow my own rule of thumb. And this is why you wait. Musketeer's gonna shred it. One hit per... Look at that, it's perfect. One hit per goblin. Level 10 goblins out of a... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alright, come on. We gotta, we gotta start shredding. Ooh, interesting. Princess. Analog? Uh, I don't know if that's the... Oh, crap. Oh, we did it! Oh my god, that actually worked! That actually worked. I didn't think that was gonna be soon enough. Oh, look at that, the Musketeer's in the tower. Oh, shoot. This is actually working. Good game. He's done. He's giving up. Look at this, look at this, look at, this. Look at the bomber. <laughs> the bomber. I think the last time I used the bomber, I was like a level three. Oh, Lord. That's great. I gotta, I gotta arrow this. That's really bad. Look at this. Oh my God. We took a tower. This guy, this guy actually just gave us a tower. Oh my god, I can't believe this. This is actually working. He's crying too. Oh, he better have a trick up his sleeve. This can't work. I mean, of course this works. Of course, I knew it would work. Oh, you mo- I'm gonna just bite my tongue now. I'll shred this up. A knight and a musketeer, I'll shred this up. That wasn't too bad. He did a ton of damage to our tower, but it ended up working out. All right, the giant, you gotta get down before the archers. Please, oh, damn it. Oh, oh, look at that. They shredded that. Uh, I don't know if that's gonna work. He's gonna kill it first. Yes. 
Oh, here it comes. I'm just going to go for it. I'm going for it. Let's go. A log. Oh, what a... Ugh. All right, this guy isn't too dumb. Oh, never mind. He's pretty dumb. He's pretty dumb. <laughs> I take him... Everything nice is said about this guy, I take back. He's pretty dumb. All right, let's go. Inferno Tower. That's the side you want to go to? You sure about that? You really want to go to that side? Okay. I'm going to shred your Inferno Tower. <laughs> oh, I love it. I'm going to let it. I'm gonna let him go on that side. Look at this. That, that tower is done. Oh, the left side's going to three crown him. <laughs> I just three crowned him. I just three crowned him with the beginner deck. You got to be kidding me. If that's not a tutorial, if that's not a how to play this game, I don't know what it is. Because damn, I just three crowned him with the beginner deck. Like, like the, you just started the game deck. Like, here it is. Oh, my God. I was going to face the trainer to show you guys how to play. I'm just going to go right there in the ladder. and oh. I just jumped on the ladder with this deck. Oh, that takes guts. I got, like, three cards left to upgrade, too. So we went in, like, mid-leveled with it. That's awesome. I love it. Damn. Okay. If that's not enough, let me know down below in the comment section. I will give you more tips. I'll give you more advice. Let me know if you enjoyed this. Let me know if there's any other crazy decks you want me to try. I'll try it, man. I'll try anything. You've seen it right here. I don't care. <laughs> but otherwise, guys, I hope you had a Merry Christmas. I hope you had a great, happy first day of Hanukkah. Let me know down below what you got for your gifts. Let me know if you got what you wanted. Let me know if you didn't get what you wanted. And let me know if you got coal. I know there's a few of you that might have got some coal. Just kidding. But anyways, guys, I will see you guys in the next one.